Here's what we envision for Uber Air. This is a very new kind of aircraft. You can see it here transitioning between vertical takeoff, cruise, and vertical landing. And this all-electric bad boy flies 150 to 200 miles an hour. It ranges up to 60 miles on a single battery charge at launch time for us. You can imagine what this does to commutes. You can imagine the gnarliest commutes, an hour, hour and a half, two hours on the ground, becoming just a handful of minutes in the air. Uber Air is coming to Los Angeles, and we're doing so in 2020. And we've selected LA as our second US city and plan to hold flight demonstrations there in a little over two years. From a safety standpoint, this has no single part criticality. That means that there's no single part that if it fails, you can't fly the aircraft. It's still safe. We signed a Space Act agreement with NASA, which is a formalization of a partnership to work on airspace management. Airspace is going to be a big deal for Elevate because we need to handle a lot more air traffic flying overseas than has ever been done before. We need a foundational reboot of the airspace system. And with NASA's cooperation, we'll work with the FAA, airports, we'll be able to actually introduce this quickly and grow it into a completely new, very autonomous air transport system based on their technology called UTM, which is Unmanned Aerial Systems Traffic Management.